Hey guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and it's about time for an update for my Game Boy Advance emulator video. So in this video, I will be showing you guys how to install Game Boy Advance for iOS on iOS 8.1.2, 8.1.1, 8.1, 1, and any other older firmware. So I did make this video not too long ago, if you guys do remember. Unfortunately, Apple did patch that. In iOS 8.1.1 and 8.1.2, the method's a little bit different, so I wanted to update it and explain things a little bit differently. So here is my iPhone 6 Plus, and uh, I'm running it on iOS 8.1.2. I got Super Mario right here. Great classic. I mean, always one of my favorites. Um, I just want to do a little demo, show you guys how sound works. I mean, it, it's literally like full speed. It, I mean, you guys have nothing to worry about in terms of frames per second or speed on older devices. Game Boy Advance emulators are really easy to run. Anyways, so in this video, I'm just going to update it and... Uh, you know, explain the process for installing the Game Boy Advance emulator on iOS 8.1.2, 8.1.1, and 8.1. Sorry, I'm just having a little bit too much fun here. It's hard to talk and play at the same time. Anyways, so I'll be showing you guys how to install all the games and run it on those firmwares. All right, and before we begin, I just want to confirm that I am on iOS 8.1.2 on my iPhone 6. So this does work on the latest firmware, and I have tested on 8.2, at least on Vita 2 anyways, it does seem to work, so I don't know what that bears for the future. But I just want to let you guys know, if at any point you want to do this and it doesn't work anymore, then down below in the description, just click on the link, it'll take you to my website, and there will be an alternative method there. So in case it doesn't work, just click on the link and follow the guide. But anyways, if you guys are jailbroken, I would recommend you install the jailbroken version. It's going to run a little bit better because the jailbroken version does have more access to system resources. So make sure if you are jailbroken, you follow my jailbroken guide and you guys can find that right here. So just click right there and it'll take you to the jailbroken version guide. I mean, I would recommend if you're jailbroken, but you know, if you guys are not jailbroken and have no interest in jailbreaking, this video will work very well as well. And there is only one requirement and that's that you're connected to the internet. Otherwise, let's go ahead and head over to Safari and you're going to need to navigate to this link. Now, in order to get that link, you're going to need to click right here to go to the full article, as well as the alternative method. You know, in case anything goes wrong, there's a full guide right there, as well as optimal settings, all that. Just click on that link and you'll get the full guide as well as the link. So anyways, in here, you guys are going to need to type in the following password, and that's all lowercase, agothro. So A-G-O-T-H-R-O. Anyways, select the green button, enter. I don't know why they set a password on it. I really don't know, but anyways, you'll get inside and just select install app. So just as simple as that, select install. And then if you go back to your home screen, you'll notice that it does begin to install. Now at the moment, it does work perfectly. However, in the past, I've noticed that sometimes it worked on and off, but for now it's working very stable. And in a moment here, we should be able to open it and we're gonna be running a Game Boy Advance emulator without a jailbreak on iOS 8.1.2. So just select trust, uh, okay, okay, and we're done. We now have it running. You know, installing games is a very simple process. Just go to search, it'll take you to Google. In here, just type in Game Boy Advance ROMs. And I would recommend Cool ROM, it's probably the fastest. So, uh, looks like it's not working. Copyright, weird, I didn't get that before. Let's actually try a different one. MU Paradise, let's try this guy. You know, just find the one you guys do want to install. I'm gonna go ahead and search for Pokemon, or there's most downloaded right here, Emerald. Okay, just gonna scroll down and eventually there should be download somewhere. Okay, and here is the direct download. So go ahead and just click on this guy right here, and here it is right here. So just click on that link. Now again, depending on the website, the process is gonna be a little bit different for the download, but. It's gonna ask you to download, it'll ask you to name it, select save, and the progress bar is up here. So we'll just follow that, and cool, I now have Pokemon Emerald. Now I just have to disclaim, only download games that you own. It is illegal to pirate games, I'm sure you guys all know that, but anyways, uh, the cool thing about this version is that it actually has haptic feedback, and I actually really like playing with it. Every time you press the button, it will vibrate, and it almost feels like you know a little bit of a real controller. So this is gonna be a long process to set it up. But anyways, optimal settings. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. Return to menu. And let's go to the settings up here. So in here, we now have frame skip. If for whatever reason you're experiencing issues, just go to one or two. I mean, anything beyond that you don't really need, but auto usually works the best, especially if you're on a newer device, you wouldn't even need to worry about this. But anyways, in here, you could play around with these settings and there's a lot. You can stream this to an Apple TV. You can use a third party controller. There's a lot you can do in here and it's so cool. But anyways, uh, especially if you rotate your device sideways, it's a little bit easier to play the game. 
and resume. So that's pretty cool, guys, right there. Uh, you know, very nice Game Boy Advance emulator for iOS 8, 8.1.1, 8.1.2, 8.1. It works on all of them. And guys, enjoy the emulator. I do hope you like it. Hope it was easy installing it. And again, if you want a faster Game Boy Advance emulator, check out that link down below. You know, it runs a little bit better on jailbroken devices. And enjoy my other emulators. I have plenty of other videos, guys. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'm always posting new things. And a really cool thing to look forward to is the new Nintendo 64 emulator. Someone's building a new one, and it should be out any day now. I'll be sure to share that with you guys as well. Anyways, have a great day. Enjoy the emulator, guys. Peace.